Ah, the mod that needs no introduction. Kaiser Redux. Lots of changes, lots of stuff. Yes, the mod for Hearts of Iron 4 has lots of content. There's one country I have been meaning to try out for just a little bit, and that one country is... Deutsche Mittel Africa. Well, Deutsche Mittel Africa. Uh, you see, after... World War One, which resulted in a German victory, yes. They basically yoinked all of the French, Belgian, and British colonies in uh, Africa. <laughs> and they formed a huge uh, colony called Middle Africa. There may be one certain guy that I am going for. I mean, he's kind of, he's kind of well-known, kind of, you, you know, you know, pe people know him. He rhymes with boring. <laughs> oh, would you look at that? Herman von Goring is a logistics wizard. Obviously, that is, um, next to adaptable. I believe that that's one of the strongest traits in the game. And now we have a wonderful seven factories to work with. <sighs> yeah, this is, um, one strong colony, I know. Ah, gotta love a name like Heinrich Schnee. Well, I know a Heydrich, but not a Heinrich. You know what? I have no idea what the Kaiser Wilhelm Society is, but I want in. I just clicked the button. <laughs> What's the Kaiser Wilhelm Society, guys? Come on. I, I want to be in the society. I want to live in a society. Ooh, I want to go on a safari. I want to go on a safari. Oh, wait, no. This is this is not the safari I want to go on. Oh, who could have who guessed? Okay, this is literally like the eighth time I've done it. It's not surprising. Okay, okay, okay. So our economy is... Oh, God, it's really bad. But, oh, don't worry. I got an idea that might work out good for us. Yeah, my bit, my bit of the old hardcore drugs there. Oh, well, this is... Hmm. He's gone. And, 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 and... Oh, would you look at that man. Beautiful. Actually, he does, he does not look that beautiful. Ah, yes, welcome to the Third International. We got a grumpy Italian... Fat Frenchman, and oh, oh, look at that chin. Ah, so the Kaiser Wilhelm Society was just technology sharing. Well, that that's not as cool as I thought. It was like a secret club, and we had like like meetings and like huge parties where everyone got naked. How much of a problem would it be if I just did a just did a little a little blood diamond? Ding? Come on. Ah, avant garde, France. Oh, what you what you doing there, huh? Oh, apparently the whole blood diamonds thing didn't exactly go great for international recognition. Now we've been condemned for human trafficking and human rights violations. Nice. Bingo, bango, bongo. Well, let's go deal with the with the Congo. Ah, uh, yes. Only Herman von Goring will use some random guy's death as a chance to spread his ideology. Whoa, that. And we're actually quite big now, huh? Uh, uh, I'm embezzling funds, but, uh, oh, oh no. What? Obviously, this is fa fake news. You see, this is obviously fictitious. Yeah, this colony is going right in the dumpster fire now, is it? Seeing von Goring fiercely resist any attempt at official investigation, the German government has seen it fit to issue an arrest warrant for him on obstruction of justice. Well, obviously, uh... No, where's your oh oh he um he definitely changed expressions and we've gone national populace oh well we're certainly taking a turn for the worse now are we oh wait I get a chance to screw over the Portuguese well obviously I'm gonna jump at that all right as Herman von Herman von Goring's first action. We're going to basically go to war with Portugal. I know, I know. I'm dumb. I should be placing guys on the border as we speak. Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, ooh. All right. Well, we're taking one step further to being a sovereign state. Yeah, we're uh, ending the protectorates, too. I'm going to finally get all my puppets together. I'm guessing that they're not going to like that. Germany isn't going to like that. Just a lot of people are going to be pretty angry, especially the people just straight up living here. So basically, I'm using my crime, Herman von Goring's crime syndicate to just get people to quote unquote retire so that they stop this whole illegal, uh, legal investigation into me. Also, Portugal, AI does not have their priorities straight, and I am about to take the only port they have here. And since they have no core territory, yeah, I'm about to see that all these guys are gonna starve to death. Haha! -ha. <laughs> why did I say haha? -ha? I don't know why, 
people would say just to take only northern Mozambique. I mean, as far as I checked, we had a war and they lost. So, uh, sorry, Portugal, this is all mine now. <laughs> oh, well. Hey, look at that. No longer condemned for human rights violations. Oh, I hate Kaiserreich, Argentina. Ah, uh, yes. Well, we've known that this officer clique behind the black dossier must have been someone in the highest region of administration. The source of the leak is more embarrassing than expected. Herman von Goring's own brother, Albert. Note, in real life, this guy was actually, uh, helped many Jews escape from Germany, I believe, and is actually a really good guy. Albert, he's been staying in Africa under the fake name Albert von Epstein. Oh, oh okay, now I have to kill We're probably just gonna say in the newspaper that he killed him. Now, uh, well, I'm curious to see what, you know, everyone will say. I'm just gonna say that I want to revoke all your sovereignty. I'm, I'm sure this will go over just swimmingly. What's not to like? You gotta look at that beautiful, I don't know, cheekbone? God dang it, we had to go right at war with the freaking Don Cuban at the same time and need to do this focus. <sighs> Fine, I'll just do like, I don't know, train lines or something. And I'm just gonna wipe. Let me just, uh, well, nationalize all the railroads and stuff that the freaking Belgians had. <laughs> now, well, uh, we wait. I don't think it's gonna be good. Time to instill some order. Oh, here it is. We're no longer hearing from border garrisons. Supply convoys are being raided at. Elements or troops are disappearing. The atmosphere... No, 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 we haven't screwed up that bad. I mean, come on. We're all right, we're, we're fine. All right, and there it is. Burundi and Rwanda. Okay, Rwanda. Come on. You know, when I thought the whole continent was gonna collapse, I thought all my puppets were gonna declare a war on me. And there's the punchline. We can, this is salvageable. We're fine. We're fine. We're taking them out. We're fine. We're fine. We're we're fine. I know. I know. Yep. Hmm. Yep. There it is. Are you ready, kids, for total societal collapse? <laughs> <laughs> so I'm trying to keep my country from falling apart. Basically, I'm I'm sure I'll win. But, uh, some guys from Japan are like, You want some Manchurian opium? <laughs> Hell yeah, I do. It seems that these, uh, these African warlords stand no match for the might of the Tanzanian military-industrial complex. Um, it's actually basically single enemy winning the war. This has, uh, been fairly easy, in my opinion. And we're, we're knocking these out. Yeah. Apparently that whole imminent collapse thing was, uh, that, nothing to worry about. Oh, hey, 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 would you look at that? The imminent collapse is gone. Now all we have is just rule by fear, opium profit, all that fun stuff. Now all I gotta do is deal with, I guess this is a completely unrelated uprising. And Goring is all set and clear. Looks like this isn't going to turn into a Goringi uh, playthrough but instead stay with Herman von Goring, which is an equally fun focus tree from the looks of it. Yeah. Now let me just uh, sweep these guys up and uh, yeah, put a lid on it. So we've been beating up the basically uh, revolutionary bandit state here. Yeah, all that fun stuff. And uh, also beat up the Dutch, which are I guess are now a German puppet. Overall, we're in a pretty good spot. My economy is <clears throat> popping off. Now I just gotta, come on, beat up the rest of the freaking Argentine. So, solve the Falklands issue. It's um. <laughs> also, uh, Germany got a sizable. I'm I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I had to do the border go. <laughs> oh boy. Well, that was fun, huh? Just before I clicked the button, you could have seen it all disappear. But w would you look at that? Of course, I'm a, a bit above the max support divisions, but boom, we're now finally Deutsch Middle Africa. No protectorist, no decentralization. Ah, disgusting. Direct control, and shortly, in a quick minute, we shall get, uh, where is it? Ah, cores. Delicious. Ah, I'm so glad we're gonna get so many new divisions out. Oh, our industry is just 
<clears throat> Just sit back and relax. Ah, oh, you know what? You know what? This is the Alsace Lorraine demand. They never, Germany never accepts this. <sighs> you ready for the war, boys? Oh wait, wait, what happened? What did they do? I'm confused. <gasps> Germany, Germany, what'd you do? What'd you do? <laughs> Well, you know, this is actually good for us, but also why? Why would they why would they do that? You know what? I'm not complaining. All that does is give us more time to get to this, which allows us to get greater autonomy, and maybe eventually, perhaps, maybe possibly decline the war, because I really don't want to get into a huge war with the syndicalists. Dealing with the British. They lost. Get over it. <clears throat> Russia. Oh. They just, uh, they didn't care. Oh, yeah, they just, they just, they just went right ahead with it. Mm. Well, god damn it, Germany. Please, please don't, please don't tell me I'm getting called in. Please, 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 please. <laughs> I don't, I don't want to fight in your war. I'm spreading my dirty German African <laughs> tentacles through France. And hey, would you look at that? General Erwin Rommel. Uh, wait, General Erwin Rommel. Going really fast through the French countryside. Hey, that sounds familiar. Well, this was a surprisingly easy takeover of France for the, what is this, third time in history? Yeah, I thought they'd be stronger since, you know, they had Alchemist Lorraine, but uh, apparently not. And as you can see, yes, <laughs> I, I, I'm, I'm doing a little, I'm doing a little work here. Uh, after this, I'll uh, just, I guess, I'll set my eyes on maybe Russia. Maybe I'll attempt a naval invasion of Britain if that their, uh, their navy is destroyed. Nope. Canada hasn't destroyed their navy yet. Well, Britain's just stronger. Oof. But I gotta say, yeah, this is uh, this is getting good. And France is gone. <laughs> Rwanda. And oh, well, that's an interesting portrait. Good thing I have a couple of divisions that I can pop out. I'm sure we can handle this. We've, we have, I've handled it with less than 17 divisions. And well, I got a fancy idea to end the war real quick. Well, it's official. <laughs> Herman Goring is insane, actually. You know, I'm pretty sure we already, uh, we already kind of figured, figured, uh, that. Hmm. We're perfectly fine. Our country isn't falling apart, I swear. Ah, uh, yes, I'd like to announce Middle Afrischke Reich. It is obviously the best name we could have possibly had. And boys, we are celebrating. Where are we celebrating? We're going to London. Oh, on, like, a paid vacation. Uh, I guess you could call it a vacation, more of a naval land. Hey, 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 I was gonna do that. Oh, you guys are pricks. See, I was trying to be a team player and my, my eye was just, okay. You see, this is why I don't trust. I didn't actually expect it, but are a bunch of uh, boys with guns, just, just poorly trained African kids with bolt action rifles. So actually it's more like uh, MP40s, but still, I didn't think we'd be the ones to take London. Germany wants to propose a single currency. Are you sure that won't hold hold back or enti the entire European continent and the far remnants of your empire? Because now all the economies are merged into one, and that means that other other parts of the country are reliant on that currency, and that doesn't matter. You know what? I don't care. Yeah, uh, Europa Mark. That sounds like a pretty cool name. Not gonna lie. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. And would you look at that? I have contributed the most. <laughs> Uh, and this is before player-led peace conferences. <laughs> well, I gotta say, we make some interesting board. I am completely content with the borders I have caused. I mean, look, this is like what the second Mexican Empire round two. Isn't, isn't, wouldn't that just be the third? And of course, I rightfully took over all of England and uh, Brittany. Don't question it. I'm just about to basically be equivalent to the Kaiser in every single sense. Oh yeah, we still have to beat the Russians. I'm pretty happy. I mean, look, I got, I got Easter Island. <laughs> what could be more fun, fun than that? Empire is now, well, we're basically just another ally of the German Empire, which is pretty cool. And we're basically equivalent. I mean, look, we got, it's basically just England, Wales, Brittany, the entirety of the middle of Africa. I mean, come on, what can, what's not to like? 
It's probably a nightmare living in here. And just to top it all off, let's uh unite the southern horn of Africa. Go real quick. I mean, come on. Basically, it was supposed to be mine, right? Yeah, they don't, they don't stand a chance now, do they? All right. Well, that is uh that's where I'm going to leave it today. I'm gonna I'm gonna sign off for tonight. I gotta say, well, that's a pretty big empire. I got us, and it's, and it's, I'm, I'm, I'm proud of it. I actually very much enjoy this. I'd love to continue this and maybe conquer the world. It's definitely something I'd be looking forward to. If they don't update the game and my save files corrupt like last time with the other playthroughs. I promise I'll do corporate Germany again another time because that seems like it would be really fun. I was going places. Maybe anarchist Germany. Who knows? Anyways, thank you for watching. I appreciate, I really, I really appreciate all you guys' support. We're, we're at over 6.5 thousand subscribers on our way to 7,000. That's insane. I never thought in my life I'd get 7,000 subscribers. And so, well, thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. So, well, I'll see you guys later. If you're interested, you can I talk to me in the Discord below. I'm always interested. I'm always uh, on there. The Patreon. Surprisingly, there's a lot of femboys on my Discord. It's why did I say that out loud? It's not surprising. me. Yeah. Well, to the patron. Oh crap! They really wanted England now, don't they? I want to give a special shout out to my patrons on my Patreon. Thank you to Stebbin, Tronathan, Moonwalking Roosevelt. Alan Curie, Aaron Moon Unit, Bismarck Lover, and Bubblegum Ice Cream. Thank you for being wonderful patrons, and I shall see you next time. Hopefully the next video is much better, and I can perform much better. Alright, see you later.